Oh, they're right there. What's up everybody? Donnie here. Welcome back to another video. Good to have you. Thanks for tuning in. Today we're going to be targeting sheep's head. It's the right weather for it. It's probably 75 degrees. Feels nice outside. And hopefully the sheep's heads are biting. I was uh, checking the docks there. We're at the boat ramp right now. And I'm seeing a couple school of sheep's head. Hopefully they're feeding. We got a dozen or so. We got three dozen fiddler crabs. So we're gonna try our luck at sheep's head and hopefully we crush it. Let's see what happens, man. Stay tuned. So these are the docks we're gonna be fishing. For some reason, if we don't get any bites here, we're gonna to have to go to a different spot. Pretty confident we're gonna we're gonna hook onto one today or two. So I got this really nice looking fiddler crab on the hook. This is a one aught circle hook by owner. It's a Mutu light. I typically use a short shank gorilla light size one aught or size one but i couldn't find the pack so we're going with the one out circle hook here's one right here guys let's see if you'll bite finally got one to bite guys he's small here it is first one of the day nice and uh a little bit cool got him on the corner of the mouth using circle hook size one out Deal. Oops. Come on, buddy. I'll let you go. You are not a keeper. If I would have guessed, this is probably 11 inches. They got to be 12 inches. He's bleeding. Pretty cool little fish, man. Good eating, too. These guys feed off barnacles, shrimp, crustaceans. So their meat is, is like similar to lobster, kind of. They call it poor man's lobster. I'm going to let him go on that side. Here we go. Dropping another crab down there. As close as you can to, to the piling right there. Or underneath. There's another one. Another small one. What's going on, man? You need to catch a bigger one, guys. Tap, tap, and he's hooked. It's actually my first time using one out circle hook for these uh, these uh, sheep's head and it seems to work just fine so far i typically use the like i said the um short shank one knot gorilla light but the one knot circle hook is pretty decent two of two didn't lose one yet all right we're gonna let this guy go this guy is little they gotta be at least 12 inches so see you dude Bycatch, mangrove snapper, baby. See ya. We probably spent about like an hour over here. Caught a couple undersized sheep's head and uh, mangrove snapper. So we're gonna go somewhere else and try to find some keeper sheep's head. I got a couple spots in mind I wanna check out. Let's go. Right here. Um. Look at that one, man. He's solid. Got him right in the corner of the mouth. We need to throw this guy in the box. Good deal. We are at a new location now, obviously. We're real by the beach. Um, the beach is cleared up as far as I know. The water is super clear as you can see. Got our first uh, sheep's head and we're gonna throw another crab down there see, see if we can uh, get on some more. Man, I'm amazed on how clear this water is though. They are all over the beach right now guys like school of them 
a big size school too, probably of like 20 or so. You guys probably can't see them, but uh, I might send my drone up there so you guys can see them. Hopefully we get one to bite this one here. Here's another one, this guy is small though. Look how, look how white he is though, his belly. That's when you know they've been sitting on the beach. You're gonna let him go though, he's small. See it. Let me show you guys where I like to hit my crab. Literally, you wanna go from the center, like that, and then out on the side, so it blends in with his legs. Just like that. Another one. This guy is small though. Same size as the other one. We gotta get we gotta get some bigger ones, man. But look, look how light he is. See ya. I got another crab down there. It's a pretty decent sized fiddler crab too, so we should get a a solid sheep's head, hopefully. That's the goal. Something bigger than that guy we caught earlier. But they were just, they were chewing right now, man. It's, it's insane. That's a big one. Dude, look at this guy. This guy's got a scar on him. Look at him. Check him out. Check him out. It's a scar. We're gonna let this guy go though. He's got a scar right there. It looks like a dolphin or something trying to get at him, but we're gonna let him go. That's a big that's a big one. That's a big one, boys. It came off, bro. That was a real big one. It was probably 15, 14 inches. That's from being on the beach, but uh, that's a keeper right there. We're gonna, we're gonna throw him in the box. There are some giants out there, guys. You guys probably can't see it, but uh, there are some big ones out there, man. Oh, he's pretty decent, actually. It's a 13 inch there, I think. We'll keep him. That's a nice one there. I thought he was small, but uh, he'll keep. Pretty solid. We're gonna throw another crab out there and uh, see if we can't limit out. We got, I see we got three already. Uh, we just need five more. If we don't limit out, I'm fine with that. Totally fine. Three is uh, plenty for me and the camera guy here. Here we go. Little dink, man. Look at this guy. Little dude. See it. This is how I'm getting them right here. 10 pound braid, 20 pound leader, loop knot on the hook. So the crab swims freely, naturally. Light tackle, 3,000 size reel, seven foot medium action rod. That's all there is to it. And uh, a lot of casting. I saw him take it. That was sick.
this guy. Five speed. He's tangled though. That's a keeper. It's a solid one there. Check that out. You can make some good sheep shad nuggets. We got another crab going down right here. I had to switch the uh, the hooks, man, because that one on Gorilla Light Short Shank, or that it was a size one actually. Size one is a little bit too small. I like that size one on. One on is just right to where when you unhook them, uh, it's it's a lot easier. Sometimes that size one is just too small, and you can barely fit the pliers in between the gap, and you end up bending it like that. So go with the one on. Here we go. We're gonna send this guy down there, and hopefully, uh, hopefully we get get a decent size one here. Here we go. Here's another one. Another decent one right here. He's 12. We'll keep him. Circle hook got him right in the corner of the mouth. That's one odd circle hook, man. It's all you need, one out circle hook. Or one out short shank uh, gorilla light. That's a wrap. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. We did not limit out today. I ran out of crab, so we're just gonna call it a day. I caught probably six sheep's head. No, five to be exact. Because I got two in the cooler and three right down there. We're gonna call it a day. Hopefully you guys like it. Give it a thumbs up if you guys like this video. Subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you in the next one. Peace.